everybody, how's it going? Mark here, Backcountry Pipe. Uh, probably my uh, third or fourth take at uh, doing this video, um, but I keep getting uh, interrupted by uh, little feet and wives. So uh, this is going to be a changed up video and a little bit quicker. Um, just more or less making it just to say hi. Uh, it's a bit of a wet day here uh, today. I got the uh, Stanwell second fired up with a bowl of uh, <coughs> McBaron plum cake. A very, uh, very nice sample sent to me from uh, Smoke and Scotch. So, uh, Smoke and Scotch, thank you very much. I'm actually on vacation this week. Um, we just returned back from Maine yesterday. Had a wonderful vacation. Went down through uh, Freeport into South Portland, down to uh, a B and B in Kenny Bunkport for a few days, and then. Uh, or a couple days and then back home yesterday so long old drive got back just catching up on some odds and ends and uh, where it is wet it's a good chance to get some indoor stuff done so uh, next Saturday will be October 1st and that brings on the start of waterfowl season here uh, for part of the province anyway so uh, I was uh, been busy digging out uh, my goose decoys which I had stored away so I got those all out. I also got uh, my duck decoys here, which I'm going to have to uh, re-rig. We uh, do a little bit of uh, lake duck hunting. So uh, these are some homemade weights. Super heavy. I'm going to change those up to a little bit more of the, uh, the lead uh, flexible weights. So... And I guess I got the, uh, the canoes all ready to uh, go. I got to do a little TLC on it. And yeah, of course, part of being parenthood now, my uh, shed is full of kids' toys as well. But uh, that's just something hard to live with. <laughs> that's all right. As well, tomorrow evening, uh, I think the tide's going to be high around... Uh, 8 30 ish or so so uh depending on what tomorrow brings there is a possibility i might uh go for a striper fish so I'm just uh gearing up the rigs here and yeah just doing some odds and ends uh good day to get ready for the for the hunting got my waders all uh all out here and bring on one of the the best times of the year as far as i'm concerned Oh, that glare is bright. Sorry about that. So, uh, so yeah, this is the first time I had uh, McBaron McBaron plum cake. I'm really, really enjoying it. I have a tin I was saving for this uh, holiday season because uh, after watching Match's uh, 860 video on it last year, I really, uh, really, really wanted to try it. Great. Uh, it's a great taste in uh, pipe tobacco. You have very little bit of a, a rum note to it. Perhaps a slight hint of Latakia. I'm not sure. I'll have to go read the tin. Um, but I don't know if you would call it really an aromatic or... I'm not sure. I'll have to, uh, I'll have to check it out Let's see. But it's very tasty. It's not an in-your-face. Uh, lots of uh, lots going on there, but they're kind of very soft and subtle. So I like that. Also, on my trip, I was on the hunt for a new pipe. Um, I never made it to the uh, cigar shop. I usually uh, stop in in Bangor when I'm in town. But uh, on my hunt for a cigar or for a pipe, sorry, I uh, I struck out. Um, for just kind of looking around, um, I was really hoping to pick up a nice uh, pipe of some sort uh, on my trip. I did get a pipe though. I uh, ended up getting a Dr. Graybo uh, Grand Duke, and uh, the only pipe tobacco I found that I seen in several of the shops around. Uh, and when I say shops, I mean gas stations and corner stores and such. Uh, was uh, Carter Hall? So classic American uh, combination right there: Carter Hall and a Dr. Graybo at. Uh, Kind of goes back to my response to uh, 
Grandpa's Cavendish video um, about uh, you know perfect pipe combinations or that type of thing. So so that's what I got. Um, very pleased with it. Really been on the hunt for Dr. Grable Royalton, but uh, those are uh, those are like hen's teeth. But um, I'm still looking for one of those. Anyway, it's been a great vacation. It's been busy, but it's uh, busy in a good way. And uh, with autumn here, uh, yesterday was the first day of autumn. Still a little warmer than usual, but uh, the cool weather should be coming. I'm looking forward to getting uh, getting in the outdoors, doing a little bird hunting. Uh, deer season on its way. Um, next Saturday will be uh, goose hunting. I have the following Monday off to uh, continue goose hunting because we can't hunt here Saturdays or uh, Sunday, sorry. So uh, yeah. Going to be real busy in a good way, and uh, thank God I have a very uh, understanding wife who grew up around uh, outdoorsmen. So, um, anyway, it was a little longer than I wanted to, just checking in, just out in the shed. Uh, once I start uh, puttering around, uh, getting the hunting gear out and stuff like that, I get in a good mood. So, and a rainy day in a pipe, what's better? So, with this, I'll uh, chat with you all later. Maybe I'll make another pipe video later, depending uh, on what happens, but... Uh, We'll uh, wrap it up there. Hope everyone's having a good day. Cheers.